Hi Stays, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing part one of the S-Class album reaction for Stray Kids. We are doing the first four songs plus an unveil. So we're doing Hall of Fame, Top Line, Super Bowl, and Item. And then we will do the Top Line unveil uh, after all of this. Um, we are starting with Hall of Fame. I have, I'm going to have to split this up in I think three parts because there are nine songs. And I'm not, sadly I'm not going to be able to get to all of it today. So I may be doing like part one one day, part two the next day, part three the, ne the day after that, just because I'm so busy. Um, but because there are nine, I think nine songs I have to listen to, um, plus the unveils and everything, uh, I'm going to have to do like three songs the next time and then two songs the last time because doing four, four, and one just doesn't like seem necessary. Uh, so I'll get all that figured out when we do this, but like I said, I'm starting with Hall of Fame. So with that being said, let's go ahead and get into this. I listen to this intro. Oh, this is already really, really good. This is really, really good. I don't know why, but I I definitely I definitely thought the chorus was gonna be more melodic than it was. Oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. The like triplets, the like keyboard triplets underneath Felix were what caught my attention. That's a deep inch. That's gotta be like a marimba or something. It's a deep keyboard. Because things like xylophones and all that would be much higher pitched. Okay, so I was wondering the first time if this was the chorus. So what I was talking about earlier must have been the... Did we just did we just put Neil Armstrong in this song? What? 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 <laughs> okay, like I was saying, the part I was talking about earlier must have been the pre-chorus. Uh, I think the part where Felix came in, what I was talking about. Not the triplets, but earlier. It's so it's so random. <laughs> Cause in the world, 
Okay. So the beginning of that song is so different from the rest of that song. Because with how they started it with Sungmin and Dian and Dahan back and Dian, I was like, oh, this is going to be like a really heavy, powerful song, but it's going to be on the more melodic side and less the like kind of shouty rap heavy side. Um, and then it wasn't. But I really like Felix's part, the quaking, the industry, that the triple, that triplet section. Um, I thought that fit really, really, really well with the rest of the song. Um, and then what I thought originally thought was the chorus was in the chorus. And then we kind of figured that out later on in the song. Um, but yeah, I was definitely expecting this one to be a lot more melodic than it actually was. Um, so, but those background vocals, I'm assuming the kids did the background vocals, but the background vocals at the very end were exceptional. So, so, so good. So the next one we have is Item. So let's go ahead and get into this. This feels like a video game. Okay, so they set the stage really well because the first thing I thought of, like I said, was a video game and that's exactly what we're going for. We're getting a lot of heavy rapper Lino this comeback. Oh, I like this segment a lot. Oh. I love, 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 love the pre-chorus. I don't know how I feel about the, like, like the actual chorus right now. But that whole section was amazing. Bin Sung, Bin Sung, back in the, having them back to back, my favorite thing ever. This is my This is my favorite part of the song. There we go. This is structured exactly how I thought it was going to be. Oh, 
Love, love, love that pre-chorus. Um, they structured it differently both times, but it was still Chan, Lino, Ian, Sungmin, um, both times. So like, which I, I mix it up, whichever way you want to do it. It was still those four voices together were amazing. I don't, I don't know how I feel about the chorus. I'm not the like I, I tell my that part. I don't. Uh, I'm still on the fence about that part. That's probably my least favorite part of the song, but lo which is funny because the pre-chorus were literally right before it is my favorite favorite part of the song. Um, but yes, the like really heavy uh, like vocal sections were so nice. So so so. Plus that Ben Sung moment. Oh oh, amazing. Aha. Okay, next we have Super Bowl, and I've heard probably the most about this one. Super Bowl and Top Line. So, like, our next two are probably the ones people are most vocal about. So, I'm very, my expectations for this one are really, really high. So, let's go ahead and get into Super Bowl. Cooking up a storm, piece of cake. Spitting out the fire, feel the blaze. Feel the blaze. Taking over, we don't play by the rules. <laughs> I'm sorry. Literally, the initial reaction anytime someone says "say the name," I immediately go into seventeen. So I almost ended up saying it. So is this in all, all in English? Ooh. I like the da 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 da. It's so good. It bounces very nicely. It doesn't drag as long as I thought it did, but I still really, really enjoy it. I like the shout out to Heyday. Okay, Stray Kids don't really do unison choruses. Uh, like, this is literally one of the f very few times I've heard them do unison choruses. So it's very different for me. That line gets me every time. Oh, 
Oh. You know what I... You know what I would have really liked in this last one? Because that buildup from the bridge was felt very, very big and very, very grand. If we'd have gotten back to the unison choruses. And then just go into like everybody. Yeah, if they had done straight into this. But maybe like shoutier? Oof. A lot of whispering in this one. But love that bridge. So, so good. I wasn't expecting a full... I don't even know if I realized or if I knew beforehand Super Bowl was going to be all in English. But I wasn't expecting a full English track, which was really, really cool. Um, this one definitely had like a darker, it felt like heavier bass sound as like the underlying instrumental, which was really, really cool. Which is kind of like I, part of the reason why I said I wished when they came back in, it would have been like a unison chorus again. Um, just to like really set in stone that deep like bass kind of feel. Um, but I enjoyed the track a lot. So our last song for today is Top Line with Tiger J a legend, Tiger JK. Um, he, this is, I guess, my second time really reacting to anything with him in it. He did a collaboration with Hoshi from Seventeen, and that was really my introduction to him. Um, but I've gotten to hear more of his stuff throughout um, from from that um, after, after that collaboration and then hearing him again now with um, Stray Kids. I'm really, really intrigued to see how this is going to go. So let's get into Top Flight. This is such a good picture, Ryan. I've noticed for this comeback a, a good portion of their pre a good portion of their pre choruses are like heavy English, which I think is really cool. I'm gonna go back because I didn't get to hear Reno. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. The like razzle dazzle line killed me. But he just like blends so perfectly into this song. Like seamless transition into Tiger JK. Did y'all hear those like the cadence? The rhythmic flow? Intoxicated, 
killing time travel. Look at me now, how but now you can't deny. But we still running on this way, cause I'm never satisfied. In me, I'm a nice I'm that could get you on the way so I didn't get your moment you tasked you to keep my speed up. Not necessarily flow, but style. I feel like Tiger JK and Han are kind of similar, if that makes sense. Like hearing them back to back, I'm like, mmm. They have their own tones, but like how they execute. Yeah. That's You can tell at the beginning of that Sigmund really led that chord, that that little section. You can hear Chan more of it in the second half. Oh, okay. This top line is probably the, my favorite that I heard. I thought the like inserting Tiger JK in there was very, very seamless. It like flowed with the style very, very well. Having him and Han back to back was amazing because that transition was seamless going from somebody who is not in the group and has their own very like distinct style and dictation. Um, get back into um, Stray Kids with their own style. But Han kind of is that like bridge between the two because like I said, they have a st similar um, style of rap. So lastly, we have the Unveiled Track 4 Top Line featuring Tiger JK. So let's go ahead and get into this. Oh, 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 oh. Han looks amazing. <laughs> Dear Lord. If there's anybody who like looks that could kill, looks that could kill Yang Jong in. Get it, look at look at that. These outfits. That felt so short. I don't know if I mentioned this earlier. I may have, but I may have forgotten. So I'm gonna mention it again. But the heavy brass sounds work so well with that very like punchy, um, aggressive rap style that Stray Kids has. 
Um, and then I feel like Tiger JK's rap style is very staccato, but it still feels kind of laid back, if that makes sense. Um, because it just, it, like, it had the perfect amount of bounce to it. Um, but it's not like a, uh, more like melodic rap style. It's still very, like, like, what would, would I explain? Um, but, uh, I feel like this, this instrumental really, really benefits Stray Kids. Like, it plays to their strings really, really well. This, uh, they looked incredible in this unveil. I loved the, like, coats and the outfits. I am, I am, <laughs> um, but Han, Han at the beginning, Jesus. Uh, but they they did an amazing job on this. Excited to see the other unveils. I think more of them that have come out have been for the like later parts of the album. So excited to get into all those. But with that being said, that has been this first part of the S Class album reaction. I will be getting to the next part tomorrow and the part last part after that, the day after that. So be on the lookout for all those, and I will see you all next time. Bye, Stays.